Hey friends, welcome to my channel Dental Edge. I'm Dr. Bhanachuk. I have started an exam series in which I'll be covering important topics of oral pathology. The purpose of this video is to help you identify topics that have been asked in previous examination. This does not mean something else cannot be asked, but the probability of these topics to be asked is much more than the others. Today in this video, I'll be covering important topics from a very commonly asked chapter, Regressive Alterations of Teeth. Also, if this is your first time here and you want to learn dental topics in a very simplified manner, do subscribe to my channel and click the bell icon so you don't miss anything. So now, let's get started with today's topic. Now, you should know this chapter properly since most of the terms used in this chapter, they are asked either to write in examination or these terms are asked as a part of VIVA or most of them can also be kept for identification as a slide in practical examination. So, you can be asked about attrition, abrasion, erosion, abfraction, dentinal sclerosis or transparent dentine. Then sometimes you can be asked to write about regressive changes in pulp or age changes in pulp. Then particularly about pulp calcification, pulp stones which is commonly asked. Now another very commonly asked topic is internal resorption or odontoclastoma or pink tooth of mummy. You can be asked to write either a short note on this or in VIVA you can be asked what is the other name for internal resorption. So you should know all the names for this as well. Next. You can be asked to enumerate or list diseases of cementum, regressive alterations of cementum, hypercementosis. Some of the terms that are not usually asked to write but you should know what are these are cementicles, dead tracks, secondary dentine. You should know the diagram of dead tracks because usually dead tracks slide is kept for identification. So friends, we are done with important topics from regressive alterations of teeth. In the next video, I will be covering important topics from healing of oral wounds. Also, I have already covered important topics from 11 chapters as you can see on the screen. I am mentioning the link below in the description box as well as here up on the screen. You can check them as well. Also friends, it takes lots of effort to make such videos. Your one like can give me lots of encouragement. So do like, subscribe, share. And thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next video.